Hello everyone, my name is Ramat and today we're going to do a Talia jungle guide in flex. I'm not going to play in Grandmaster because I'm gonna get destroyed because my main lane is mid. And we're going to talk about in this video about runes, builds and what whatever else you need to know in order to play this champion. I'm against uh, Predator Timo with Smite. I, yeah, this is weird, but I'm against this. And we can see already by analyzing a bit the comms on top, there is exhaust, uh, there is flash ghost Darius, which will want to fight the ignite flash renekton, so we gotta be there. On mid lane, we have CC, on bot lane, we have CC. This is kind of the perfect comfort for Tulia, because everyone in my team has CC. But we gotta do ganks as, as much as we can, and we gotta try that. Stop it, because you annoy me with that animation, Jesus. I'm playing with Dark Harvest, Cheap Shot, Eyeball Collection, Ravenous Hunter, Nimbus Cloak, Celerity, and these rune stats. I'm starting right here at blue. Going and then to red, going to right, somewhere there into the mix, and we're going to try to help Renekton win the top lane by doing an early fight. Man, they helped me so much though. Look at this. Oh, I haven't had a time in which I went this well with the farm. Anyway, I'm going for I'm going for the right, going for the red. And then when Renekton is level 3, I'm going to be able to actually help him. So I'm gonna cast an E down under, so that I'm getting healed by them. I'm gonna cast here the potion. I'm not gonna cast a smite yet. I don't think I'm gonna cast a smite on this one. And... Well... <laughs> I think the master plan with ganking top failed. <laughs> oh boy, that's not cool. Alright, so we're gonna start doing this. Gonna kite, kite, kite. I'm gonna get auto attacked twice, it's fine. Three times. And hopefully not Timo counter invade. Alright. Also a kill on bot lane is fine. Gonna smite it. Gonna go in the range so that it doesn't reset. Alright, and then I'm gonna focus on the little one so that I make so that I make the level up from him. Right? After we made level up, I could just W them away. And then we kite this big one, right? So it's fine. I see Lux used everything on mid. They have nothing on top as well. Lux should back off at this point. And I am seeing... I am seeing Timo on the map. He's going towards the buff. Right, Renekton still has... Renekton still has the Ignite. So that means we can actually try here something. But first, I just want to... Oops. Oh boy, did he get it? Damn. So we just we just go into the bush, we wait for the Darius, we engage on him, and if he wouldn't AFK, that would be great. Where 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 is bloody Darius? Okay, right. Go 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 go. Alright, full combo here, should have passed the kill, but it's fine. So now Darius lost the entirety of the wave, Renekton at this point should actually 1 versus 1 him pretty easily, and we won, I consider this lane won, so I'm not gonna bother ganking again. And I should have probably passed the kill, my intention was not to get the kill, was the last auto attack that I shouldn't, I should have calculated better. Also I see problems on mid on bot, Timo ganked mid, for some reason they got the kill because of the Timo gank. Two CC less champion made the kill on a barrier flash Lux, for some reason this is a legit thing, I'm not not keeping up with it, I know Fizz deals lots of damage, but man. We need to now to gank bot mostly, because if we gank mid we have to do it so perfectly, we gotta hate our lives, but we're gonna try regardless, so... I'm going Wolves, and then I'm going to think of a mid situation helper. But first here I'm going, and oh boy. Right, coming, coming. Alright. Can't help you more than this. He's just gonna beat me up if I go there. Now I can't kill him, man. What I can do is push your lane. And now we see him coming here. Okay. Really? Is this dive happening? Shut down. 
proc there another stack of dark harvest and it's fine i backed off obviously i back off there because of the of the impending darius renekton pink did his job right lux would have still died so it's it doesn't matter really now i'm 2-0 and i need to play around both sides even though i don't really want it in terms of farm because i have here i have here my rights and my golems i like this more than wolves but I'll go here, I'll go here, I'll wait. Uh, I'll try to gank. Actually, I'm coming. Now, Fizz is 6, and because he's so aggressive, he'll probably do a dumb mistake and try to engage. <laughs> he didn't solve anything with that buddy. And now I can just I can just run it down here. I can just go towards him. He lost so much with that. He lost his ult. I, I even am able to take this for free. I don't know, that was a pretty trollish play from them. And at this point, I could think of ganking bot. Definitely could think of a bot gank here. Right, get him, boys! Nice! Right, now I'm going for the scuttle. I'm looking towards it because I don't see Fizz, so I'll have to be extremely careful. Okay, I see it now. Uh, I'm seeing that it spawns on the top side, so I'm going for the blue. And I'm gonna ping this guy and this guy to be careful. On bot, they are safe. If Timo comes on bot, they are 2 versus 2. Leona is going to deal with it. On top lane, though, I don't want to have problems with that. Alright, so right now we power farm. We power farm this till the AP jungle item. So I'm just gonna auto attack this. Probably going now. Nah, not a, not gonna smite this. See, see, as I said, Renekton right now wins, and he has a complete level advantage over the other guy. So that's fine from our point. I see, I see Fizz. So it's okay. He, the Renekton is fine. Who's pinging? Oops. Thank you. I got scared of that little. Also, I might think. Uh, okay, here I might get ganked by Fizz. So that's why I'm, I'm backing off here. So I'm trying to stay a bit away from this. Normally he would come to this side, so I would expect him here. Also, I'm gonna kite this as much as I can so to not go into that range. So I'm going here, right? And then... Going this and that. This is the plan gonna take just the big one in order to be able to quickly try oh bot lane is winning now see see but the problem is that Fizz is going bot there all right this is a free kill now man stun faster please come on get the kill how did i get that one <laughs> no all right so we move here we try to attack this guy we know Fizz is on the bot side. Not gonna. No, 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 it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine, man. Man. Don't do the stupid things. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're very good here, actually. I'm gonna cast a Q here. I'm gonna just. Not gonna get more than I need. So I'm gonna be decent, I guess. And then we move towards bot lane again. And I'm not recalling to get my item even though I should. But I want to help bot again. And they are coming. We can set up a gank here. I will have mana for at least a combo and alt. So it's fine. I could go here. I could go deep here. Could go till that. So actually. Actually just gonna wait for Leona to clear that bush. Wait, 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 wait. Just, just, just let them. Let them, please. Let them. Alright, so this is the engage on Swain. They are engaging on the Ezreal and killing the Swain. Okay, we got the Swain as well. That's fine. Top lane winning, only mid. Only mid had the problem. We got the kill here. That's a good, that's actually pretty good ganking. Gonna recall here outside of their vision, gonna try to uh, not steal gold from this. 
yeah didn't steal gold from this we can think of drakes yes the the pinks is good in that area that's what we should do so i'm going for this item going for the ap jungle item one vision word then i'm going for this this and this this is the order that we want i go here because uh this guy might be ganked by either fizz or the other i know fizz is fed but having two lanes, three lanes swing, if I consider myself to compare to just... I'm not sure why Timo still camps mid. I'm not sure of that. I could just hold here. Alright, and we probably lose the scuttle here because of this misposition, well, misposition, <laughs> the roam, I guess, the gank top, I will just work here, check, okay, you see that's wrong, I'm gonna get this, then I'm going to think over moving towards Drake, I don't, I could think of a herald here as well, but I'm a bit scared that I won't have time to actually take it before Fizz comes, so that's the logic, right? Now, we won't top lane pretty hard because for some reason Timo decided to come mid and while they got fit, Fizz ahead, I got both bot lane and top lane ahead. Lux is now just the guy who's going to die this game and he has to try just to be useful. We cannot save him. Even if we give 3 kills to Lux at this point, he will still die. And I don't like if he dies here. Okay, that's fine. That's, he did. They also got Drake because... Go there in time. Okay. Instant double kill here. We can get the first tower. We lost. We did lose the Drake. Because we should have been more careful. We should have. We should have definitely been more careful. <laughs> but we can take this now. Simple as that. Two levels as advantage. And. Fizz can actually try to jump on us. If we defend ourselves here, it's okay. Just back off. Just back off, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Uh, the Renekton died on top, I've seen that, but he probably sacrificed for the tower. So, still, first tower is good. Also, at this point, Fizz being here actually gained us a lot of momentum, a lot of time for the mid lane and I could actually think of ganking again just wait, wait alright go 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 come on, come on I'm gonna gank for you okay that was bad, that was horrendous my bad, but we can think of getting the tower now we see Fizz and Timo on mid lane right? Maybe next wave, because he ulted. I could just recall though, because they will eventually deal with it. You, you gotta be, man, you gotta be careful. Uh, they are still fine. They will be fine here. I'm going for Oblivion Orb and uh, for two Fusion Words. Renekton will probably be fine, even though he died, he did fine. And I expect them to win, to certainly win this, exactly. Because I gave so much to Ophelios and Leona, I gave them so much help. Uh, this is fine! Even though Fizz got the kill, this is fine. And we got the kill on bot lane, we got the towers. I go mid because I want to... I know he has no ult, right? So I want to push this. And I know he also used that spell. That means I can be annoying. Right? Like this. So I'm just gonna push and then let... Actually gonna take the next minion wave as well because Fizz cannot do anything being that low HP. I'm gonna dodge this spell. I'm gonna push, then I'm gonna move towards that. And I am taking mid farm because I, if I do a full push, yeah, he holds it, but it's it's not that great that he does that. I'm just gonna cast E before the scuttle, the herald, sorry. And then I have a vision word there, that's mine. Oops. I'm gonna need some help here. I have flash, and we're gonna use Renekton as the main guy to tank shit, and it's fine. And man, All 
Alright, they protected nicely. And we're gonna get the kills on Timo right here. Okay, get him. Gonna recall after the dot ends and gonna bo go bot straight bot because no one is there and we need to protect that area. Gonna sell here this, gonna finish this. So you can see I'm trying to, uh, well it was too late. I'm trying to move around the map as much as I can. I'm 703 by the way, 11 stacks in 16 minutes. This farm is too beautiful not to take to be honest. And I'm gonna ping this, I'm gonna probably cast Herald to actually draw attention. And I'm gonna ping him to go there. I'm not gonna take that, that's yours. Because I took your farm. It's fair. And I'm gonna go red. And then... So I'm pinging like that, because I'm first going here. Lux flashed. And maybe I could save her, but... Yikes. Big yikes. But still, I cannot go red anymore. I'm gonna stay here. And we're just gonna wait. Alright. Instant kill. I would clear words from this. Oops. But I can't. Because I don't have that. I have the red... The... Herald, sorry. Right. But Leona clearing this is amazing. Drag him out. What? I'm lagging because of the frame drops all right maybe i did a bad i surely did a bad smite there but we we fulfilled its deal so it's fine now i could think of ganking here and lux at this point should just get the zone yeah to be honest no i'm not what is lux doing I should probably check my red for some reason but i don't know so i'm just gonna power farm now because i'm gonna get a lot of farm at this point at a very fast speed so i want to farm as much as i can holy that was a bad combo also i need to keep an eye on the herald all right so i'm gonna do another q here actually i'm gonna pass them going to go here and i'm gonna ping him to come because i'm thinking that okay we, we don't need him anymore because we got this real Oh, prediction, predictive, good one, good one. All right, so I'm gonna cast this. I see Timo on top. Oh no, he had time. Heal. <laughs> Still, I did my part. <laughs> I misplayed that greatly, but it's fine because on um, the mid lane we actually destroy now that Aphelios has 200 years, by the way. So we got the play. Oh no, <laughs> the death of the Herald. Alright, guys, guys, start clearing the jungle up. Because that's what you gotta do after you get this advantage. You can see Fizz is 6 1, but that doesn't matter at all. Okay, this is. Whoa, the damage from 1 EQ. And she didn't even hit it. But yeah, you can see how well they perform after I went bot and top. I ignored mid and it shows because Timo basically camped mid, ganked like a lot of times. And we focus now mostly on the players we camped. I got advantage, huge advantage from top, from bot. I got... Alright, I got this. I got them up also, so Renekton is pretty strong. And even though Darius can do Darius stuff, Renekton being extremely... Tankish, one shotish. It's fine. It's exactly what we want at this point. Gonna smite that. WEQ, small Q again. Maybe pop the E, right? Going back here. Pushing, pushing, pushing. We lost no towers. Actually, we lost on bot and now on top. And I'm gonna defend mid. So we don't lose it as well. And I wanted there. I hit Q so fast. I wanted to actually pop it on Ezreal. Adopt, we got anything here. And get that, thank you. Now I'm gonna move here. We need to think in terms of that, in terms of uh, the next objective. And that should be, that should be this. 
I have red trinkets. I, I'm pretty sure we can. Oops. And we need to actually completely check it. Okay, go. I have ult to stop them, and I see Fizz on bot, so I don't have to. But I will ult regardless if they come around. And I need to do a full Q from this distance. And Timo might run at us. Which is. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. Alright, and good smite. And this is pretty much the game, guys. And I suspect we can just run them down at this point. We shouldn't generally around this. And we got another stack of Dark Harvest there instantly. And we kind of tilted them. I believe this can be done against any jungler. Imagine the enemy jungler, whichever that is, camps mid lane. And you win the other two lanes because he doesn't batter that much. This is against any matchup really doable. Got him. Wanna get out of the... Oh, okay, thank you Lux. Even though Lux actually got camped and she died, she didn't lose the game, right? She wasn't any reason for the loss of this game. For She wasn't nowhere near it. Unless I would have tried to gank their, her lane. If I went mid and tried to 2 versus 2 them, we would have lost. This guy will kill us all now. If I don't hit a perfect <laughs> combo there. If I tried to gank mid, remember, we would have lost because team already established dominance there and got the kills. Now, the simple way of playing around this is just to gank other lanes, to go where the CC is, where the matchup, the skill matchups are. They could close the gap, he could close the gap, Lux couldn't really because Fizz has E. I focused on that and the game went perfectly for us. This was the game and I really hope you enjoyed it. And see you next time guys, I'm gonna probably do this week another mid video with Pantheon. In uh, I'm gonna try to do it in Grandmaster, hopefully I got a good game. Generally when I win games, when I, I win the lane I lose the game and when I lose the lane I win the game now. In that, when I play Tulia though it's fine. We're going to see how that goes, but this was the Tulia tutorial. I really hope you enjoyed it and see you next time guys, goodbye.